Hello and welcome back to another Python 3.7 tutorial. My name is Tom with MasterCode Online. As always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Also, leave a comment below and let us know how we're doing. Um, all right, so let's get started. Man, I am struggling today, so just bear with me. We're going to talk about the insert list method in Python. Basically, what the insert list method does is it takes two arguments. First argument being the index position where you want to insert an object into the list and the second argument is going to be that object we want to insert to the list. And we we are not overwriting the object that's currently at that index position. We're just basically pushing it backwards. So with that being said, let's get started. A is going to represent a list. And that list is going to be master. And we're going to have uh, online like that. All right. And basically, if you know what our website is, it's master code online. We're missing the code in there. So we're going to insert code. All right. So we're going to have B is equal to a string that says code. There we go. And then we're going to say a dot insert. And we're going to say at the first index position. So zero one right now, that's how it's set up. We want um, code to go in here, right? So we're going to go ahead and pass B as our second argument. So the first argument is your index position. Second argument is your uh, object that you want to insert into the list. So hit return and call A, and there we go, mastercode.online. All right, so what happens if we try to pass a list into a list, all right? A is equal to a list of numbers, and B is representing a list of, oh, wait, hold on, crap. Anyhow, uh, nice rewrite this he's you know, there's a reason why I did this five and six square brackets uh, B is equal to square brackets one two and three square brackets and then we're gonna say a dot insert and we're gonna say zero index position so right here all right and we're gonna insert uh, B so actually right here is zero and Close out that method, hit return, call A, and we got one, two, three, and four, five, six. All right. So we're, it only takes a, it takes a single object and inserts it. So it's not iterating through the, through the, um, the iterable data type or the list and inserting them. It's inserting the whole object. If you guys have any questions, please let me know over at MassCode Online or below in the question or the comment area. Otherwise, I'll see you in the next tutorial. 